it's time to spill the tea. All right, so the conservatorship Britney Spears claims is toxic is now coming to an end. Britney Spears' father, Jamie Spears, is asking a California court to dissolve the 13-year conservatorship controlling parts of the singer's life. In an unexpected move yesterday, Jamie filing a petition to not just walk away, but end the agreement. The conservatorship put him in charge of Britney's business in financial affairs following her public breakdown in 2008. The father-daughter duo have been sparring in courts over the past year, with Britney accusing him of conservatorship abuse. Jamie recently saying he would step aside and step down as conservator, but not until the time was right. The time is right now, sir. Okay, read the room. Thank you, and you are dismissed. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Sounds like freedom, I'm hearing. Okay, so up next in the tea, after releasing albums in the same week, fans of Drake and Kanye are in a heated debate over whether Certified uh, Lover Boy or Donda will take the crown. Apple Music reports Drake is the most streamed artist and his album CLB is the most streamed album in a single day. Spotify also says that the album became Spotify's most streamed album, oh, sorry, in a single day. When it comes to album sales, Drake CLB sold more than 500 175,000 copies. Donda, on the other hand, sold 309,000 copies, according to the New York Times. Tough debate, but of course, you know, I'm Team Drake all day. His song, Way Too Sexy, is way too lit. I love it. <laughs> all right, up next, Chrissy Teigen is celebrating a milestone the author and TV personality posted on IG over the weekend that she's been sober for 50 days. She said this is her longest sobriety streak yet after a few setbacks over the past year. Teigen says alcohol doesn't serve her in any way, and she is unsure if she'll ever drink again. Tegan has stepped back a bit from social media as she grapples with the depression following the miscarriage that she had and revelations that she was trolling people online in the past. Now, she apologized for it, though, okay? So that's good. Good for you, Chrissy. Don't sleep on those mocktails, girl. Those things will. That sugar rush is going to feel like a four loco without the loco in it, okay? Uh, but I'm proud of her. All right, up next, rapper Cardi B is introducing the world to the newest member of her family. The 28-year-old posted a photo on social media of her with her husband and rapper Offset and the couple's second child. The newborn was wrapped in a blue blank blanket and Cardi B's post included a blue heart. The couple told People Magazine the baby is indeed a boy, if we couldn't guess that already. And the couple already has a three-year-old daughter. Uh, together, Culture Kiari was born in July of 2018. Congrats to her. I wonder if she's gonna name the baby Barty. I feel like, you know, the boy version of Cardi would be Barty, right? I feel like that's what it should be. <laughs> All right, that's it for the tea for today. Now, y'all know what to do. Y'all better go sip on all that tea. <laughs> All right, let's turn our attention now to the weather.